What's up YouTube, it's your boy Mix here. And today I bring you a cyber dark deck profile um, using the structure deck. And uh, of course, as always, it's casual, it's for fun. So uh, please uh, drop a like and uh, comment and subscribe. So you know how it goes. Let's start off with the monsters. All right, here we are with the monsters. With any uh, cyber dark deck, you play triple cyber dark claw. Uh, it searches uh, any spell and uh, trap card, any cyber dark spell or trap card in the deck. You discard it. Then when it's equipped to a monster and it attacks, you can send one monster from your extra deck to the graveyard. And that is very important in a cyber dark deck. Uh, next, we have a triple cyber dark cannon. Um, this one, you discard it and you search any cyber dark monster. And if the equipped monster attacks, you can send one monster from your deck to the graveyard. Then uh, we play... It is a cyber dark deck, but you need cyber dragon core because it lets you search one cyber spell or trap card. And obviously cyber dark uh, has cyber in its name. So you need to play three of these because it can search you literally any spell or trap in the deck. Then for a little protection, we play double effect Valor. And then here, some of the new cards, we play double cyber dark chimera. Uh, this card you can discard a spell or trap card and search a power bond from your deck. It also lets you fuse um, From your graveyard by banishing so it's essentially it's a walking uh, Miracle fusion it, it's it's pretty nutty, you know, and uh, it, It's nuts. It, it's just so good in the deck then for the cyber tarks. We play the best one double cyber dark edge One cyber dark horn One cyber dark heal and being it is a machine deck, you got to play one Jizzy Kree, the Star Destroyer Kaiju. And you got to play the one Cyber Dragon because, you know, you got to make Cyber Dragon plays. And then my little favorite tech, Dark Honest. I want to find a, a, a room for a second one. But uh, for now, that's what I'm playing. Dark Honest is just funny. And when you drop it on your opponent, they're going to be like, what? And the entire deck is dark. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty fun. So now let's move on to the spells. And here we are with the spells. We play triple of the new Cybernetic Horizon card. I know it's a wallet text. It's pretty nutty. But the first text says this card is always treated as a Cyber Dark card. So you can search it with um, um, Cyber Dragon Core or, or um, Cyber Dark Claw. And then, um, so let me read this to you. Uh, send two dragon and or machine cyber monsters with different names to the graveyard. One from your hand and one from your deck and one dragon or machine cyber monster from your deck to your hand and if you do send one machine cyber fusion monster from your extra deck to the graveyard you can only activate one cybernetic per turn and then you can only summon uh fusion monsters from the extra deck so it basically loads your grave up twice um it sends a cyber dark fusion from your extra deck to the grave so you can easily make cyber dark and dragon and then it's also a searcher so it, it does literally everything for the deck then we play triple of the next new card cyber dark realm this one basically when you activate it you can search any cyber dark monster to your hand and then it gives you an extra normal summon which is uh nice just in case you want to combo off or or go for game then we play triple cyber emergency uh it, this is to search cyber dragon core mainly or to search Cyber Dragon if you're going second, so you can just make um, um, the Chimera, Ch Chimera Tech uh, Mega Fleet Dragon to take your monsters uh, extra extra deck away. I mean, extra monsters in a way. Then we play double Cyber Dark Inferno. Uh, this is just protection, and uh, when it's destroyed, you can search a Cyber Dark card, and then also you can swap Cyber Dark monsters, which is really nice. Then we play double Overload Fusion. We got to get easy access to the to the cyber dark and dragon we play one cyber dark impact just because you know it's easy to fuse we play one power bond to search for um with the chimera and then we play one lim limiter removal because it's a machine deck and you need to otk all right let's move on to the traps okay here we are with the traps we play double cyber dark invasion and i only play four traps uh this one states once per turn you can target one cyber dark effect monster and equip it with one dragon or machine card from either player's graveyard 
which is uh, pretty nutty. And then it gains a thousand attack. Then uh, you, it's also some a form of protection because you can send one equip um, card that's equipped to a machine monster and then pop one card your opponent's controls. So, you know, it's a nice double form of protection. And then the other one is Rivalry of the Warlords. All we play is machine monsters, you know, so it, it's pretty nice there. All we play is machines, so we won't have to worry about going into anything else. Uh, let's move on to the extra deck. And here we are with the extra deck. I play double Cyber, Dark, and Dragon. Uh, the boss monster of the card. Um, it must first be fusion summoned or special summoned by tributing one level 10 or lower Cyber Dark Fusion monster equipped with Cyber and Dragon. So that's two ways uh, to summon it. Then it's unaffected by your opponent's activated effects. Then once per turn, I can equip one monster from either graveyard uh, to this card. So it, it doesn't matter. You can attach anything and then it, it can it can attack as many times as it has equipped monsters. So if you have three equipped monsters, it can attack three times and it's a 5,000 body. So imagine you power bond this with Chimera, Cyber Dark Chimera on the field. Then you, um, that's already 10,000. And then you limit a remover, that's 20,000. That's game in every way, shape, or form. So it's a, it's a real, real nasty card when you get the right cards. Then we play double Cyber Dark Dragon. You know, this is the classic, the casual one. And you need this to make this. Um, that's why I play two of these. And the way you can equip it. Um, is with the cyber dark trap card the cyber dark invasion so you can equip uh cyber and dragon to this with cyber dark invasion then tribute this to summon that it's uh, it's it's pretty nutty and that's why i play one cyber dark um impact as well then we play double cyber and dragon because you need these two to make this so that's why i play two of everything then i play one cyber darkest dragon just uh, as a tech you know in, in case in case i need to uh, overload fusion and everything in my deck um, and I just want to play it. It's casual. You know, it's a Cyber Dark deck, so I want to play it. Then, because you play Cyber Dragon Core and a Cyber Dragon, you can make Cyber Twin Dragon with a Power Bond or Over Fusion. Then, obviously, you play all the um, Cyber Dragon um, ex extra deck cards. Cyber Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon. Chimera Tech Over Dragon. Chimera Tech Mega Fleet Dragon. You know, you play all of them. Uh, then, I play Triple... Elder Entity Ntis. Uh, the reason I play triple of this is because when uh, Cyber Dark Claw is equipped to any of your, cy um, your Cyber Darks, when it attacks, you can send one card from the extra deck to the grave. And Elder Entity Ntis, when it's sent to the graveyard, you can pop a card. So you will attack, effect, send to the grave, and then you pop something on the field. So it's nutty. And then last but not least, one Cyber Dragon. Seeger because it's a you know we play cyber dark machines but yeah that's the deck let's move on to the combos okay here we are with the combo video this deck you want to go first so you go one two three four and five okay first you play cyber emergency so you can search cyber dragon core then you activate uh cybernetic horizon so i'm sending one light dragon attribute to the grave and then i am sending one dark machine attribute to the grave so they're both machines then i can add one cyber dark card monster from my deck to my hand so i'm going to add cyber dark cannon then i can send one machine monster to the grave so i'm going to send Cyber and Dragon to do that. Then we're still not finished. Then I can discard a uh, Cyber Dark Claw to search a uh, Cyber Speller Trap. So I'm going to go ahead and search Cyber Dark Realm. I'm going to activate Cyber Dark Realm and then I'm going to add Cyber Dark Edge to my hand. Then I'm going to discard Cyber Dark Claw. To add to add cyber dark horn right so I'm going to normal summon cyber dark chimera then I'm gonna activate chimera's effect by discarding one spell or trap I could search power bond then I'm gonna activate power bond activate power bond fusing all five one 
two, three, four, and five. Now instead of this, I'm gonna have to use Cyber Dark Edge. Five, two, special summon Cyber Darkness Dragon. And I'm only gonna take 2,000 of 2,000 damage. One, two, three, four, five. I'm only gonna take 2,000 damage because Power Bond says I take whatever I gain, so it's double of 2,000 is four. So I'm only gonna take 2,000 damage. Then effect, uh, when it's summoned, when it's summoned, um, I can uh, target one dragon or machine and equip it. So I'm gonna equip this. Then I'm gonna tribute this to summon Cyberdark and Dragoon Dragon. Then I'm gonna activate Cyberdark Dragon's effect to equip equip uh, Cyber End again, just cause you know, anime. And now it's unaffected by anything. You're sitting on a 5,000 uh, 5,000 attack uh, monster and then it, it can attack once right now and next turn I can attack twice so you're kind of just sitting on this end board and you're like bye and then if, if you really wanted to you know it's pretty nutty and you only lost 2,000 making that so uh, it, it, it's pretty it's pretty it's pretty great it's pretty great now let's do one going second shall we all right here we are going second two three four Five and six. Oh, Dark Honest. This is this is okay. Um, I'm gonna go activate Cyber Dark Realm to uh, search uh, a Cyber Dark card, and I'm going to search Cyber Dark Claw. Then I'm gonna go ahead and discard Cyber Dark Claw to search Cybernetic Horizon because it's always treated as a Cyber Dark Claw. Then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, activate Cybernetic. Horizons effect uh, by discarding Cyber Dark Chimera and Cyber Dragon Core. And then I'm going to search Cyber Dark. I'm going to search Cyber Dark Edge. Then I am going to send Cyber and Dragon. Then um, I'm going to activate Cyber Dragon Core's effect. Uh, this card's name, um, I can. I said I can banish this card from the graveyard to special summon one Cyber Dragon monster from your deck. So I'm going to banish this. Then I could either summon another Cyber Dragon core or special summon Cyber Dragon. And then depending what they have, I can go I can go off, you know. So if they have a monster, let's say they have a monster in the extra monster zone. Let's say they have a monster in the extra monster zone, I can go to Mega Fleet. So let's just say they have a monster in the extra monster zone. And do that then go chimera just to get rid of their board their monster then here i'm going to go ahead and discard cyber dark cannon to add to add cyber dark horn then i'm gonna i'm gonna uh normal summon cyber dark horn activate its effect attach this then i'm gonna go cyber dark realm extra normal summon activates effect attach I'm gonna attach Cyber Dark Claw. Then I'm gonna go ahead and enter my battle phase. I'm gonna go ahead and attack directly with Cyber Dark Edge. Cyber Dark Claw's effect activates. And I'm going to send Cyber, uh, Cyber Dark and Dragon. Then I'm gonna attack Cyber Dark Horn. Then uh, damage step, drop Dark Honest. Then uh, Cyber Dark Cannon's effect activates as well. So I'm going to send Cyber Dark Keel, because next turn I can make Cyber Dark Impact. Then on uh, my main phase two, I'm going to activate Overload Fusion, banishing Cyber Dark Dragon and Cyber Dark End Dragon to summon Cyber Cyber Dark End Dragon. Then I'm gonna activate the effect. So I don't have anything to equip from my grave, so I'm gonna equip something from their grave. So let's just say equip something from their grave. And that's it. So next turn you have Cyber Dark Impact set up. Um, they're gonna attack your monsters, so your Cyber Dark Cannons are gonna go off as well. And then you have a protection board right there. So that's your end board going second. Um, hope you guys like this deck profile and combo video. I know this 
um this became one of my favorite decks um but yeah please don't forget to comment like subscribe it's your boy mix signing off thanks again